Hey everyone, welcome to Crack MRCS channel and this channel is dedicated for MRCS examining. So here the discussion the discussion today. Here is the question. A 56 year old lady with metastatic breast cancer develops an osteolytic deposit in the proximal femur. One morning while getting out of the bed he noticed severe growing pain. X-rays show that the laser trochanter has been avulsed, whose muscle is most likely culprit. Here we can see a 56-year-old lady with metastatic breast disease cancer develops an osteolytic deposit in the proximal femur. One morning while getting out of the bed, he noticed severe groin pain. So this point is important, severe groin pain. X-ray shows that laser trochanter has been Evolved, which muscle is the most likely culprit here the finally the one student which muscle is attached to the laser trochanter that uh, causes contraction and laser trochanter evolves due to osteolytic deposit in the proximal fever so the one to know that which muscle is attached to the laser trochanter here is the options the options are vastus lateralis, psoas major, piriformis, gluteus maximus, gluteus medius. So here we can see the proximal part of the femur here uh, is the head of the femur, the neck of the femur, uh, here the intertrochanteric line in the anterior part and intertrochanteric crest in the posterior part and greater trochanter, laser trochanter. In the question, the uh, notice that the avulsion of the laser trochanter occurs. So we have to find out the muscle which is attached to this laser trochanter and contraction of the that muscle causes avulsion of the laser trochanter. So here in the second picture here we can see here is the laser trochanter and in the laser trochanter first of all this muscle this muscle arises from the iliac fossa and then it inserts it into the laser trochanter and this muscle is called iliacus so first of all we know that in the laser trochanter the iliacus muscle is inserted so contraction of the iliacus muscle may cause avulsion on the other hand in the right side we also can see the above the psoas major muscle above the iliacus muscle there is another muscle that is psoas major muscle and this psoas major muscle it originated from the we can see the lumbar vertebra all the lumbar vertebra here and then it descend down above the iliacus and then finally in the inserted into the laser trochanter so you can see here the laser trochanter there are two muscle attachment here one is iliacus one another one is psoas major so any of the two muscles is responsible for uh, contraction and uh, it is responsible for avulsion of the laser trochanter so here find out the two muscle iliacus and psoas major you can see the psoas major present here so uh, the psoas major muscle who is attached to the laser trochanter and it causes contraction and the laser trochanter got avulsed due to osteolytic deposit of the proximal femur in a breast cancer patient and other uh, options we can see the uh, vastus medial vastus lateral is the inserted in the shaft of the femur uh, and piriformis, piriformis, it originated from the sacral bone and inserted into the uh, greater trochanter gluteus maximus it lies in the gluteal region so which is far away from the laser trochanter and gluteus medius a, a, these two muscles lies in the gluteal region so there is uh, the less chance of uh, um, involvement of the muscle actually there is no uh, chance of involvement of this muscle uh, as uh, uh, these two muscles are far away from the laser trochanter thank you all so our final final answer is swas major muscle because in the laser trochanter two muscle at us and one is swas major another one is iliacus thank you all